Hey there, it's Beta Squared. Welcome back to more of an Untitled Story. We are in the weirdly famous blank land. It moves on its own, and it has this absurdly strange background. And it's kind of hard to navigate because you have to compensate for like the movement of the screen as well as your own movement. But it shouldn't be super spectacularly hard considering the fact that we have to deal with giant floating arrows trying to attack us. See, there's like some segments that aren't super difficult, which makes us rather not insane. Oh god. That heart is kind of hard to get. I have to like concentrate on a, on a weird scale. And it just, I, I just need like the timing or else, I, I, or else I cannot get it for the life of me. There you go. I, I, I need... No. No. I can't get the heart. It's, it's probably, it's a hard heart to get if you don't have a very specific power up. Which I don't have actually. Which isn't super necessary. Ah, oh, so close. I will get this heart. I know I can get it. It is just. It just requires. Wow, that went right between them. It just requires a level of skill that I kind of possess. It went right between them. How am I doing this? Pencil man. I need you to stop trying to kill me because I just I just need to use one of your bodies to get up into a heart. Oh god. I think I did it. You got a heart. That took two minutes of your time and two minutes of my time to get it. And they don't even give me a magical thing, which is rather quite unfortunate. However, we're gonna continue along the mess of blank land and it's gonna get quite a ways ow quite a ways more shaking up we're gonna shake things up the screen is gonna shake things up now is there a heart here i have no idea although i am curious ow ow god no i want to Kill them all. Ow, ow. Was there anything here? No, that was just a waste of my precious time. Okay. See, this part wouldn't be super horrible if the screen didn't constantly shake. Which it's doing, and it's really throwing my brain off on a tangent. Oh lordy Lou. See, why is this place flat? It's like, why is this place flat? But it doesn't matter because we made it to a save point. Hooray! And I don't have that power up yet, which kind of really sucks. I mean, I, I guess. I get it. But there's a boss coming up. His name is Mr. Uh, Boxman Magoo. Although, I... Oh god, I can't, I can't think. The, the shakies. If only I had that ceiling slidey power up, I could just negate the s Oh no. Oh, it's fine. You know what? It's fine. I need, I need that ceiling sliding power up because that's not where I wanted to go. I wanted to go back there. You're getting a preview of a thing that I haven't done yet. Well, I mean, I, I am doing it right now, but I'm doing a very poor job of how I am doing it, which isn't super bad. Mr. Red Dust Guy floating in the air. I need you to just be still, my... My... My god, my brain is hurting every time I jump because I cannot see where I'm gonna land. Is this the boss? This is the boss. Took us only five minutes. And I don't know how he is. Is this Tetris? Is this Pong? That was probably not a very good idea. 
Is he gonna shoot anything? Is he gonna land? No? What are you doing, Mr. Boxman? Can you, can you, uh... Oh, this is what you're doing. You're just sliding around. Err! You shouldn't be too super hard to deal with. You're kind of just like a Tetris block. Or one of those, uh, brick-breaking games. Which I don't remember what it's called. Is it just called Brick Breaker? It's like one of those old fashioned -y games that I haven't played because I don't like playing mobile games for the most part. This is a good game. I think if you have listened to me on the first episode, was it the first episode? I took damage. I don't want to take damage. Err! Die, Mr. Red Box Man. What do you have to say for yourself? Anything? I mean, like, I don't know why you're attacking me. I don't know what your purpose is in this magical mystery life that you have. Why did I jump into that? Who knows? Who knows? Alright, Mr. Red Box. Which is kind of a metaphor for something. I don't know what it is a metaphor for. But whatever it is, you're about to die. Red Box. Magical Box. Thing box. Oh no! Spikes flying from the sky, flying from the air, trying to crush me in all of my despair. And I'm having actual legitimate trouble trying to keep up with the box. Oh god, it's gonna it's gonna hit me at some point. I just I just I just feel it right now. It didn't hit me yet. Boom, you're dead. That's it, and that's how I feel. Let's get that heart piece, and let's move on with our lives. Because I somehow missed that, I, I, like the, the shakiness is, it's messing with my head. We found another gold orb, and I still don't have that ceiling sliding power up. So let's go to Mr. Bonus place and try and get one of those power-ups because I have more cash which means I have more gambling money and more gambling money equals more ways to go broke in this game unfortunately here you go give me my heart if I I want I kind of want the power-up all right let's see I'm gonna go with box number three again and I got screwed over again what the fuck are you serious? It's a 1 in 3 chance. It's a 1 in 3. Okay, you know what? Let's just go with middle, and if middle screws with me, I'll just... Are you serious? What the hell? What... What the actual... What is going on here? Is every box I pick not the right one? Okay. Let's go with middle once more. Thank you. Hooray, we want a heart. All right, now let's just do this one more time because I'm curious. I'm curious. I am curious. You know what, let's just do Mr. Third Box because we got the power up on our first try. And now crystals will automatically absorb into us, which is very nice. Although, I don't think my computer will have the processing power when we beat that boss that gives us, like, a shit ton of crystals. Which is rather kind of unfortunate. So, what do we head to next? Because we kind of finished Blank Land for the most part, considering that, uh, you know, I didn't actually kind of finish it. I do have- do I have the yellow power-up? Well, I do have the yellow power-up, which means I can go grab that heart. Yeah, yeah, what do you have yeah, to offer? A yellow orb and a heart. So I'm just gonna get this heart. You got another heart, and we're at 500 hearts, or at least 500 health. I think we do have the yellow power up, which means we can get this heart. Hooray! I wanna see what's down here in the far fall place thing. Although, uh, oops. Ow, that was a minor screw up on my part. We're reaching at the 10 minutes, although I'm gonna continue this on for about 
few more minutes. Er, I just want to see what is going on, and if I no, I need that. I I need that slidey power up, and I don't remember where it is because I I cannot get there without the slidey power up. So if you've enjoyed, thank you for watching. Uh, in the next episode, I'll figure out what to do, and we'll move on with our lives, and hopefully advanced in some sort of direction, which is any direction, really, because the direction we go is the direction we're back where M Mr. Merton Milled Guy is, and we're gonna just go into here and see where this takes us. Oh, that's nice. Thank you, game.